Hello everybody, this is Jason. If you are a returning subscriber, welcome back. If you are new here, welcome. I post contents related with WebRTC, JavaScript and Golang. If this interests you, please hit that subscribe button and stay updated. In today's video, I'm just going to go uh, do a little show off of a um, media soup app that I have uh, prepared um, as a premium starting kit. Uh, I just want to show you uh, what, you know, this, uh, what do you call it, this starting kit includes, what functionality. So I'm just going to show you quickly. And to get this, uh, there's a link down below. Okay, you can go in that. And let me show you um, what this is all about. Okay, first of all, I will start up the uh, server, okay, and then I'll start with the client, okay. Uh, basically, the server has been written in with uh, TypeScript, and the front end has been written with um, Next.js, okay. Um, it's a pretty, pretty good stack. Uh, the back end is TypeScript, and the front end, I choose to use JavaScript. Um, that way, uh, you probably understand it better um, for those who don't really understand TypeScript okay anyways let's get started and test what we have here okay first of all we have a login screen okay so we will like put in your name and we'll do a room okay we'll do it as test test room okay and we join and we go okay all right so that's the first pair and let's grab another one and we can do this by sharing the link with this button here so we push that and that will give you the um, URL of the room okay and we just push copy we close that and we go to the second one we paste that in okay and here we go we join this group uh, this room sorry and now if we want to publish camera uh, should I split these into two things eh? it might look, at, look better like that okay uh, let's start publish from this guy here we publish the video all right there you go it comes up straight away uh, i'll put that on headphones so it doesn't give you echo okay and the second guy okay you can choose to um what do you call it um share his um screen okay uh, let me do that hold on a second uh hold on okay the second pair we go share the screen okay we want to i got two screen here if you are wondering why i have two okay we go share okay here we go and we want to push this onto the main display all we need to do is just click okay we have that and we can have this in full screen so basically we're seeing the other pair is the screen screen share i'll show you what i mean so if i go to my other screen if i do change things see it's all live here all right uh, let's get out get out of the full screen okay now I want to change my mind uh, I want to publish my uh, what do you call it my camera oh sorry uh, I I want to change it to a whiteboard or blackboard okay what I need to do is cut this off okay we'll take the camera stream off and then we do this one here okay we're publishing the whiteboard now see on the other side so if this guy clicks it and we start drawing okay whiteboard shows up okay we can basically do live presentations like this okay you can go extra mile by putting a pdf or uh or a picture into this um frame here and they will see it live as well see this is all live um, through webrtc all right um so this this starting starter kit is ideally um you know all the all the functionalities all done okay all you really need to do is do your authorization um i just think you know uh, because media soup is a pretty difficult thing you know to get into if you sort of haven't have any contacts with web rtc and my aim is you know just just make it easier for people you know to get started on it and most of the functions there also this is uh, multi uh, users as well okay uh, to prove that uh, we can i mean we can open a few more okay uh, okay let's take the hold on we take we publish back the camera okay so we can see our camera okay and now he is the new peer okay we go okay see we have the streams here okay we've got three peers 
can do another one, no problems, because this is this, this is supported. Um, uh, I've done some tests, okay, uh, it will do 50 users at least, like easily on this, okay, that depends on your hardware, okay, and also you can check out the uh, MediaSoup um, benchmark <clears throat> to see how, how many pairs you can do, alright, so there, there you go. And also, um, the reason why I do this before, because I have promised I'm going to do a media soup um, basic tutorial. The reason is I want myself to be familiarized with uh, media soup before I do a basic tutorial, so you can get the best out of um, you know the videos I'm about to um, uh, publish. Okay, I hope you enjoy this. Uh, if you like this, um, please um, follow me or hit that like. If you like it, hit that like button. And if you're interested in the starting starter kit, okay, um, it will be in the descriptions uh, to link it to my website to get it. And uh, there will be a discounted um, coupon. I will put that one up there as well. All right, thanks very much for your time, and we'll see you soon.